Piglo Land. Cookie, please. Katie watched her brother eating a cookie. Can I have a cookie too? Katie asked her mother. What's the magic word? Katie's mother asked. Uh, I don't know. Katie tried to reach the jar. Why did he get one? Katie pointed to her brother. He was polite and said the magic word. Her mom explained. Katie asked her brother, What's the magic word? But her brother was too busy chewing to answer. Cookie, Katie said impatiently. Her mother shook her head. Mm -mm. She put the jar away. <laughs> Katie watched her brother eat his cookie. Can you please tell me the magic word? Katie asked. Katie's brother said, Please is the magic word. Katie jumped up and down. Please, can I have one? Her mom gave her a cookie. <laughs> now, what do you say? Thank you, Mommy. Katie gave her mom a hug. <laughs> Jack's shopping list. Jack was helping his dad shop for groceries. They ordered cheese. The grocer handed it to Jack. What do you say? Jack's dad asked. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Jack replied. Next, they ordered some fresh pasta <laughs> from the deli. Thank you, said Jack when the clerk gave him the package. They went to the farmer's market and ordered apples. Thank you, Jack said when the farmer gave him the bag. What is all this food for? Jack asked. His dad bought some tomatoes and gave them to Jack. It's a surprise, his dad said. Jack and his dad walked home carrying their grocery bags. Thank you, his mom said when Jack delivered the groceries. She sent them out of the kitchen to make the surprise. The surprise was cheesy tomato pasta and baked apples. Jack and his dad knew just what to say. Thank you! Patty's first day of school. Patty walked into the classroom on her first day of school. She didn't know anybody. She sat quietly at her desk. At recess, Patty saw another girl crying. Patty asked her, what's wrong? I'm new. I don't have any friends, she said. Patty stuck out her hand. I'm Patty. I'm Beth, she replied. Patty and Beth <laughs> skipped rope until recess was over. After school, Patty and Beth walked home together. <laughs> Patty told her mom, This is my new friend, Beth. Patty and Beth played on the swings until supper time. Finally, it was time for Beth to go home. I'm really glad we are friends, Beth said. Beth gave Patty a hug. 
<laughs> we are going to be best friends. They both giggled. Penny and Mary. Penny the fox bounced her favorite ball. Mary the pig asked, Can I play too? It's my ball, said Penny as she bounced the ball. Her friend Mary grabbed the ball and ran. Bring back my ball, Penny yelled. I want to play too. Mary bounced the ball. Penny ran after her. Mary hit the ball behind her back. Please give it back to me, Penny told Mary. <laughs> Mary handed Penny back the ball. <laughs> Can we take turns playing with the ball? Mary asked. But it's my ball, replied Penny. Hmm, I don't want to play with you anymore, Mary said, walking away. Penny ran after her. Wait! Let's share the ball. Penny bounced it to Mary. Mary bounced it back and said, Sharing is fun. Tammy's Day Out Tammy went on an early morning boat Hello. ride. Good morning, she said to the captain. Tammy went to a restaurant for lunch. Good afternoon, she said to the waitress. Tammy went to the beach in the afternoon. Good afternoon, she said to the lifeguard. After dinner, Tammy went to the movie theater. Good evening, she said to the ticket man. Tammy ordered some popcorn. Thank you, she said to the lady. Tammy came home after the movie. Did you have fun today? Her parents asked. I did. Tammy replied as she hugged her mom. Good night, she said to her mom and dad. Tammy's day out was full of fun. She hugged her teddy bear and fell asleep. Kidlow Land